Could Windows 10 applications soon run on an open source operating system? For Tech Republic and ZDNet, I'm Dan Patterson with Tech Republic's Nick Heath. Nick, tell us all about the React OS. So React is basically an operating system, an open source operating system that's been developed to be compatible with Windows. Um, at present, it will run um, some older Windows software, so uh, dating back to Windows XP, Windows Server 2003. Um, it's basically the older uh, operating system that uh, is based on the Windows NT 5 architecture but they've just updated react os so now it's going to be able to uh run in a very experimental fashion it's still a very early stage but it's going to be able to run some vista windows 8 and windows 10 software as well so it's starting to move towards being uh, a more modern windows compatible operating system obviously with the difference that it's it's free and completely open source yeah, so what are some of the advantages of running uh, Windows 10 uh, apps in an open source OS? Well, their ambition is to have an operating system that they say has none of the data gathering that currently happens within Windows 10. So all of the telemetry um, data gathering that you currently see in Windows 10, none of that is there. Um, and also, Obviously, it's a free operating system as well. There's no, no charge for it. Um, and it's open source, so you can go in and inspect the code um, and actually see that you trust what's actually within the OS. So, so trust is a big part. Well, it looks like we are truly in a new age of not just Linux or open source, but also Windows. Nick Heath for Tech Republic. Where can we go to learn more about Windows 10 innovations? Go to Tech Republic and check out our story on React OS, and you'll find other stories about what's happening with the Spring Creators update. Uh, Microsoft just updated why that was delayed.